Hey peeps, welcome to the Crafty Witch UK. My name is Arietta and today it is the time of the month where we open the latest witch casket. So this is the December 2023 witch casket and so this will be the last one of the year. It is the Yule one. Um, so let's get inside and see what goodies we have. Okay, so we can see from the booklet that this is lunar magic. So that is gonna be the theme for the box and we should see this, this artistic style and um, the theme running throughout the entire box. As always, I'm gonna pop the booklet to one side, have a little rummage and then come back to this afterwards. So we start off with our art card. This is really lovely, like, you know, kind of a woodcut design almost. We've got our little witch there. She is outside. She is in the woods by a beautiful crescent moon. Really, really lovely. And on the back, we have our manifestation prompts. So what are my goals for the month? What practical steps can I take and what magical steps can I take? This is a really nice way to utilize these cards as more than just decor. I really like them as meditation focuses um, because it gives your brain something to latch onto rather than this idea of think of nothing. So um, using this as a bit of a prompt, but also having something to fill out. You could keep this in a journal. Um, you could just have it. Um, in your sacred space or even on your desk throughout the month um, and keep checking in thinking am I am I manifesting my goals and then you know, next month you can either keep the same goal with a different card or you can work on a new goal I think it's a really lovely idea okay it looks like we've got some sort of bag let's have a look so yeah this is a tote bag with the lunar cycle on it very nice indeed it is a witch casket exclusive by the looks of things it's got the witch casket logo on there it's a really nice linen bag or cam canvas linen i'll have to check uh, but yeah very nice looks to be screen printed perhaps but very nice indeed i always like useful items so each month you get a spell kit. This is a manifestation charm bag kit containing everything you need to attract what you desire. So let's have a look inside. Okay, so we've got, oh, again, we need smell vision These smell phenomenal. We've got a gorgeous little printed bag again. Really nice drawstring bag. We've got another lovely art card with our spell information on the back. So we've got two sachets. Uh, number one is bay leaves. Number two is rose hips. Um, We've got a tiny little scroll that we can fill out and that's held together in a little gold ring. So that's got all of our instructions, words to say, and then it says at the bottom, once you feel the pouch no longer serves, you can return the herbs to the earth and cleanse the bag for reuse. So nothing is wasted. Very nice indeed. for this one we have got a hanging plaque um, you could I guess if you wanted to take the string off and use it flat up on your altar um, to hold crystals or to charge stones under the moon um, 
it's very nice that they've used a crescent moon design because of course so much lunar magic people think of the full moon and doing full moon rituals but of course you can use all the moon's phases for different types of magic so it's nice to have something a bit different this is really pretty and um, ties in really nicely with the tarot card um, plaque from last month uh, I'll pop a link to last month's video um, but it was in the same style as this with this kind of laser etched wood really really pretty okay I've got to do this one now so, this is a magical moon water bottle harness lunar energy and add it to your magic use this enchanting bottle to create and or store magical moon water so, oh oh my goodness i oh i'm in love wow this is so so pretty um just stunning that lovely patterned glass we've got a stopper here which is round lovely clear symbolizing of the full moon and then the crescent moon here really beautiful i love that an awful lot we have got a rainbow moonstone pendulum okay, just the packaging on these things is just beautiful so it says, hold the pendulum by the chain and allow it to settle. Ask a yes, no question that you know the answer to, to see which way the pendulum swings. That will allow you to ascertain directions for your pendulum. Then you can ask questions where the answer is unknown and see what insight the pendulum offers. So I do love Moonstone, it's so pretty. So this is the rainbow moonstone which when it catches the light just right you will get that rainbow shine of it the sort of iridescence very very lovely indeed and it's just got a little crystal on the end or a little glass bead so yeah really really nice love that Uh, what is your favourite form of divination? Do you are you a pendulum person or a tarot person? Do you like runes? There's so much to choose from. I'm a big fan of this pin. So you get a pin every month. Um, this one is obviously a little black cat sitting in the crescent moon. Um, I myself have three black cats. Um, so this is particularly apt for me. I love it. Really, really beautiful. Um, yeah, pleased with that. I'll just give you a nice close up. Really lovely. Each month we also get a scroll. So, scrolls are always done up with a nice sticker. Can I get these off? This is the question we ask ourselves. If you go slow, you can do it without ripping it and without having to cut the sticker. So, here we've got magical phases of the moon so it goes through all the phases of the moon telling you what sort of magic they are most suited to so um, yeah really lovely and like i was saying it's not just all about the full moon so you can use all of the phases with the scrolls i know some people pop them in a little clip frame and they'll display them um i myself have started adding mine to a sort of scrap book of shadows um, that I'm creating. Um, previous to that I had them in a folder in plastic wallets so that I could flip through them. You could of course cut them up, you could copy out the information into your book of shadows, use them any way that you like. We have got some very very lovely smelling moon magic incense so light the incense and affirm i call upon the power of the moon to surround me as i work my magic an enchanting blend of rose and myrrh so let's have a little look in here um the quality of their incense is always outstanding 
yeah, really, really beautiful. And I think there's probably normally 15 or so sticks in there. Uh, but yeah, very, very nice indeed. And I think I will probably use one of those for my Yule ritual. And finally, ooh, what have we got here? An enchanting crescent moon crystal tray to grace your altar and keep your small crystals close by. The tray is also useful to place your crystals onto your windowsill or outdoors during good weather to cleanse your crystals in the moonlight. Oh, oh yes, that's lovely. Can you see that again, that etching in there with the crystals? Really, really beautiful. And it's a great size. Yeah, it's a great size to be an offering bowl it's solid wood really really lovely yeah so we have been spoiled this month frankly so many lovely lovely things so let's have a look at our incense tray we've got a pin yeah, so, so much lovely wooden wooden things which is always nice our decision kit bag and of course, what I consider to be the star of the show, the moon bottle. So, just pop back into the booklet and have a little look-see. So again, the, the theming just runs through so beautifully. Due to the high demand, we honour the magical moon with our lunar magic casket. They're already planning their 2024 caskets, so it's well worth following them on socials to see if you can get some little hints. So we've got our water bottle, the crystal tray, these are all exclusives, the wooden plaque, also an exclusive, tote bag. Whether you're out foraging in the magical outdoors or visiting your favourite metaphysical store or you simply want to show your love for magical moon, this tote bag will do the job beautifully. The incense, charm bag cat on the moon enamel pin perfect for any jacket or bag <laughs> so, and the lunar print here was designed by their in-house designer Faye and that again is exclusive to which casket so yeah really lovely as always so I highly recommend Witch Casket. I am not sponsored or affiliated with them. They are a fantastic UK-based small business and I just really like what they stand for. They do ship internationally, um, but prices for the monthly kit for the UK start from £29 and um, yeah, I think it's so, so worth it. Um, you're going to get some wonderful, useful magical items that you just won't be able to get anywhere else. And it's a great way to bring something new into your magical practices if you're a seasoned practitioner. And it's a great way to start if you are new to this path. So let me know down below what was your favourite thing that I got. Um, and let me know if you would consider getting a witch casket in 2024. I know I am certainly going to continue getting mine and sharing them with you on this channel. So um, have a fabulous new year and I will see you for the next one. But until then, stay crafty.